Retaining walls. Definition. Retaining walls are built to hold back the ground and slope. Their function is not to support a building. Dimensions. Depending on the ground quality, a retaining wall should be at least 30 centimeters deep and maximum 90 centimeters deep. The height of the wall should not be more than 2 meters 50 above the ground level. Inclination. The front of the retaining wall must be tilted towards a slope in a ratio of 5 to 1. This means, for every 5 centimeters up, lean back 1 centimeter. The back of the retaining wall, the invisible one, must be vertical. This inclination ratio of 5 to 1 gives stability to the wall and balances the loads. Construction of a stone masonry retaining wall. The following rules must be followed when placing the stones. Stones must be placed flat, not on their narrow side, and tilted backwards. Never vertical or horizontal. Stone layers must be at right angle to the front of the wall. This way they won't be pushed out by soil pressure. It is necessary to place large through stones from the back to the front of the wall. The stones must be placed using mortar. To reinforce the retaining wall, horizontal concrete bands must be added, tilted backwards and at right angle to the front side, and which are reinforced with lengthwise rebars and perpendicular stirrups. These reinforced bands are the strip foundation placed on the whole length of the wall. Middle ties, in case the wall is higher than 1 meter 50 above the ground level. And the cap band, which is placed on the top of the wall. Drainage. Drainage pipes must be placed every 1 meter 50 in height and spaced horizontally by 1 meter 50. They must be slightly inclined towards the front of the wall to allow water accumulating in the ground to flow through. It is important to build the drainage bed at the back of the wall, 30 centimeters thick and made of gravel and stones. <laughs>